In today's geography video, we'll be doing something a bit different. We're going to be taking a look at your geography. Because YouTube shows me in detail every single country that has watched my videos. So I think it'd be interesting to have a detailed look at this because I want to find out things like which country has watched my videos the least. And there's some really interesting data we can look at. So we'll start just on my audience tab of my analytics. So you can see that in the last 90 days, we have had 17 million returning viewers and in total 27 million unique viewers. And on YouTube, generally it's quite nice to have a healthy splattering of both types of viewers because if you've got plenty new viewers it means your channel's growing but if you don't have many returning viewers that means that people aren't coming back because they don't like what you're doing and it is kind of insane to me to see that on the 11th of June I had 1.3 million people watch my geography channel that had already watched my geography channel at some point before like that's a crazy number of people but yeah you can also see that I really churn out the uploads on this channel like we had a short coming out every single day Day plus maybe one or two full length videos. I've slowed the shots down in the last couple of weeks because I was worried that I was maybe overdoing it. But if we scroll down, we can see which videos I'm releasing are growing my audience the best. Weirdly, it's flags made out of food is the top one and everyone else is low. Okay, brilliant. <laughs> and we can also see where my viewers are most active. And interestingly, on the Geography channel, you're active every single day from like noon till 7 p.m. Ah, hang on. So I was just about to say that on my Jack Sucker Life YouTube, YouTube channel. It normally says that most of my viewers are active like Friday, Saturday and Sunday. However, I've just logged in to check and it's much the same. You're active every day and I have just remembered that it is the summer holidays for most schools at the minute. So there's just way more people watching YouTube all the time. All right, anyway, we need to get to the main stuff, the geography. This is a geography channel, Jack. So here we are, top geographies, last 90 days. And our top five countries are United States, United Kingdom, very much expected. India, that has crept up a lot over the years just because India is so big in YouTube now. But then the third one is Philippines, which is quite rogue. And then after that is Australia, which I would expect, maybe Australia or Canada. But we can also switch from all views to just views from shorts, and that's when Canada pops up. Or we can see just views from full videos, and that's when Philippines goes completely. So obviously the Philippines viewers are basically just watching my shorts. But we can go way deeper than this by clicking see more. And suddenly we have so many countries. So my lifetime views on the Jack Sucks and Geography channel are 600 million million, which is epic, and a pretty colossal 128 million of those came from the United States. And then the United Kingdom makes up 88 million, which is pretty epic considering that is higher than the population of the UK by like quite a significant chunk. By the way, you'll see my average view duration is all quite low at like two minutes, and that's because it's combining the average view duration of my shorts, which can't be longer than a minute, with the average view duration of my full length videos, which are generally like about 10 minutes. But anyway, there are loads of different countries here, but what is interesting is that some of the countries are blue. And that is because if I click on them, I can see the specific nations within the UK. So 83% of my United Kingdom views came from England. And then you see that Scotland, Wales and Northern Ireland make up the rest. So I'm curious if these percentages mimic the percentage spread of people in the United Kingdom. So 84% of the UK population lives in England. Oh my god, and I've got 83.4% of my United Kingdom views from England. So that exactly aligns. We have a totally proportionate number of English viewers. But what about the others? Oh, Scotland's 8%, whereas my views are 7%, which is pretty close. Wales is 5.2%, whereas my Wales percentage is only 36 which suggests that generally, overall, people from Wales don't like me quite as much as people from England and Scotland. <laughs> Which is quite sad and ironic, given that my last name is literally the word Welsh. For Northern Ireland, it's 2.9%, which is really close once again. So yeah, literally what we've proven with this data is that overall, the Welsh don't like me as much as the rest of the UK. <laughs> So now if we go back to the main country list, you'll see that United States is also blue. But the United States isn't split into four smaller sub-country things, so why is it blue? Well, it is actually split into the different states, which is kind of epic. Look at how much data we've got available to us. So I know these three are all very populated states, so it makes sense they're at the top. But what we're going to do is we're going to have a scroll down, and I want to find out which state is our least popular. And I also want to find out, is that the least populated US state? Because if it is, 
isn't, then I'm in a bit of trouble. Vermont, 101,000 viewers, which is very low out of my 600 million. What is the least populated US state? Please be Vermont. Oh, it's second least populated. Wyoming's actually at the bottom. So where else is Wyoming on our list? Because if it's not near the bottom, that means that the people of Wyoming really like Jack Sucks of Geography. 12 seconds later. Oh, uh, never mind. <laughs> so YouTube only gives you the top 50 results and you have to export it to get more than 50. And Wyoming was number 51. <laughs> so the data are actually perfectly aligned. So we've had 84,000 views from Wyoming. Oh, it actually aligns perfectly. My least viewed are Wyoming, Vermont, and Alaska. And the least populated are Wyoming, Vermont, and Alaska. Then is it North and South Dakota? No, DE gets in here. Is that Delaware? Yeah, the Dakotas are above that. That means on average, the people of Delaware don't like me as much as everywhere else. <laughs> okay, we'll also show India just for our 59 million India viewers that might be watching. I don't know enough about any of these provinces to be able to kind of input anything insightful, but I will show it all so that you can tell me something insightful in the comments. So now let's just scroll through the countries and see if we can find anywhere surprising. So Philippines is really high on the list, and I didn't even know they spoke English in the Philippines. Okay, apparently 92% of Filipinos can understand English, so I guess that explains why they're so high on the list. But I think YouTube must also be pushing shorts there a lot, like they are doing in India. So scrolling through, we have Australia, then Indonesia's really high, but it is just a very populated country. And then we're going to have quite a few European countries, just because English is widely understood overall there as well. Malaysia's there. How many Malaysians speak English? About 50% of the population can speak English, but there's only 27 million people in Malaysia. So how does that compare to the views? 9 million. That just feels pretty high to me, because generally I'm just going to be far more relatable to a UK person or a US person, because our cultures align way more. Although saying that, these are all of my views over the last three years, and the Malaysians only equate to 1.6% of all of the views I've ever had, which isn't that much. But it does seem going forward, it's just distributed very, very closely between all of the other countries. Like, all of these are below 1% of my audience. And now North Macedonia is our last result, but that is because we only see the top 50. But don't worry, because I've already exported the entire list. So it's not as pretty as YouTube. Let's go through this entire list. Okay, so this is where we got up to. But there are still so many countries underneath. For example, we've got Japan there. 700,000 of my views have come from Japan. That is a tiny, tiny percentage. Look at this. Keep on scrolling. Oh, I'm assuming that's Kazakhstan. Still 460,000 views. There could be at least one Kazakhstan person watching this video right now. Okay, keep going. We need to get to the really obscure ones. So we're on less than 200,000 views contributed now. Hang on, we're already on less than 100,000 views contributed. So the bottom of the list is going to be a combination of countries that just have barely anyone that speaks English. English and also countries that just have very few people in them. So this is Fiji at the bottom of the list. Fiji literally has less than a million people in the entire country. So obviously they're not going to be able to contribute many views here. We are going very low. We surpassed Yemen there, 29,000. This is just so low. Oh, I should try and make a prediction, shouldn't I? What do I think it is? I know we did look at the same list many years ago when the channel was just launching and I'm sure that it was just like an obscure African country. So I'm going to guess at the bottom we're going to have like Eritrea and Djibouti. That's going to be my prediction. So let's do it. Let's find out. We're on 170, so it's got to end at about 200, presumably. I think there's a few territories included, such as Hong Kong, etc. Oh my god, it's still going. Whoa! There we go! The bottom of the list is XK. Where's that? Kosovo! I've not had a single view in Kosovo, an actual European country that isn't crazily far away from me. Alright, interesting, but what I actually need to look at is the country above Kosovo, which is SH. Of my 604 million views that I've had on this channel in the last three years, just 12 of those views are from SH, and it was probably all the same person just watching 12 of my videos. So where's SH? I have no idea. Oh my god, it's St. Helena, the British Overseas Territory. That is crazy. So if you don't know, it's just a tiny, tiny little overseas territory just next to Africa. Literally, they have a population of 4,000. Crazy, thinking about someone right there watching my videos. I mean, potentially they were on holiday there, but does St. Helena have many holiday visitors? All right, we also had 14 views from NF. Where's that then? It's the Norfolk Islands. Oh my god, we really are international. That's... <laughs> 
crazy. Surely they were on holiday. Someone that was doing a bit of island hopping around New Zealand, etc. 21 views, nearly twice as many from NU, which is the island of Noi, which I never know exactly how to pronounce. Very pretty place that is just once again in the middle of absolutely nowhere. <laughs> so how many times do you need to watch one of my videos to qualify as like an actual active viewer, an actual fan? Do you think it needs to be at least 20 videos? Obviously, I don't know of the 21 views. Potentially, it was one person watching 21 times or potentially it was 21 people who watched me once for 47 seconds and then got the hell out of there. <laughs> okay, last one I'm going to look into is NR, which is Naru, apparently. That's so sad because I've mentioned Naru in so many videos, but they've not bothered to watch them. <laughs> They do have a population of just 12,000 though, so I, I, I can allow it. <laughs> All right, very interesting analytics here. I'm sure there'll be some interesting little things that I have not noticed. So if you spot anything, please feel free to discuss it in the comments or over on my Jacks of Geography subreddit because I'm not gonna lie, I need some better posts on there before I can do another video. <laughs> All right, thanks for watching. I'll see you later.